what's up guys um my name is swizzy hd and um this is a quick little video on some of my color corrections and i usually do them on after effects now but these are some of my other corrections color corrections that i did on sony vegas which are pretty cool too so i'll be showing you that and um probably make a tutorial on my after effects ones too but i just got my whatever cam tasia i just got the trial or whatever I couldn't get the regular one. I don't know why. I mean the key gen one. I don't know. But um, yeah, that's about it. I'm gonna show you guys how to do it, and I hope you guys enjoy the video. So um, first off, I'm gonna start with um a quick brightness and contrast, which will just make it a bit darker. And these are the settings right here: 0 0.03, 0 0.17, and yeah, that's about it. I I don't know why I have that negative sign there. I might I don't think it does a difference. But yeah. So just copy that down. Oh what the hell? Oh yeah, it does make a difference. My bad. Yeah, put that negative sign there. And um next you could add um the ones I've been using recently if I on my Modern Warfare 2 videos which uh, I don't do anymore, I do Black Ops, but um this is one that I did a lot, which is um, which is basically curves, and um, um, to to do it, all you gotta do is um, untick show all channels, and you don't have to do nothing with RGB. You just click RGB and go to red. So try to so right here you see like a little line. All you gotta do is try to copy, make it similar to what I have. Maybe you can make it even better. I don't know. So copy that down. And now I go to green. Pretty similar to the red. You can copy that one down. And then blue. Which is pretty cool too. And that's about it. And then you can add a little sharpen. And I used to add more than like right here. Add just zero sharpen which still increases the quality but before I used to add like 0 0.02 but the thing about that is Black Ops is a I don't know in my opinion Black Ops is like really sharpened the quality is different from Modern Warfare 2 so I just add a bit less sharpened than I used to add and uh, yeah that's about it oh add the sharpen and uh, I'm going to show you the next color curves, which is another preset. This one is um, it's a more of a reddish one, as you can see over here. Um, untick show all channels again. And you don't do anything with RGB. All you got to do is go to red. And uh, I really put that red really high up there. But yeah, you got to do that. And then try to make just make the line look like this anyway similar will make it look good so then I do that then I do a uh, green pretty similar to the one I had before a bit different and copy that down and then blue yeah and that's about it with the sharpening and the same brightness and contrast and looks pretty good and the last one um, is I have random names for them. This one's a nice one too. And it's basically color curves again. And this one, all you gotta do is untick show all channels. And this one, you actually need to use RGB. And you make it look like that. Just like that. Then you go to red. Then you make it look like that. Just make it as possible, as similar as possible as you can uh, I don't know if I'm stuttering or not this is my first tutorial so please don't hate I don't like that and okay this is this is um green just make it look like that and blue just like that and then I add the sharpen and brightness and contrast and it turns out to look pretty nice um yeah so um I also have another um color correction that I used to use. 
I don't use it that much anymore, but I had requests on how I did that. So basically, I still have the same brightness and contrast. And, oh, I still have the same sharpen. Yeah. So all you got to do for this one is a uh, color corrector. And then you go down. I have a preset. And it's a more of a purplish one. Um, looks pretty nice too. I haven't really been using that one too much. So I've been using After Effects color corrections. And yeah, so I think you could add more of a. I have a other brightness and contrast that might make it look better. A darker one, if to your liking, might make it look better. Let me show you the f what I gotta do for color corrector. So basically, um, you change the angle to 49.4. This is low. You change the angle to 49.4. Magnitude 0 0.286. Mid angle 321.3. Magnitude 0 0.298. High angle 140.7. Magnitude 0 0.441. And I don't think you have to change these settings, but if you do, just make it look like that. And that's about it. You might want to change the brightness and contrast to this. Leave the negative 0 0.03 and then add 0 0.38 just to make it look a little darker. So it might be better. And yeah, that's about it, guys. Um, each color, like the color curves I was showing you, each one looks better on different maps. You choose one to your liking, that's what I usually do. I add the same brightness and contrast. And um I just add a sharpen and then the color curves. But um yeah, that's about it guys. Um I'm gonna probably be making another tutorial in After Effects on how I did a purplish color correction. And uh, I also did a some type of s dirt, like a dirt effect. I'll show you how to do that. And yeah, that's about it. And thanks for watching. Um, I also um, am I'm also making a a new video. It should be soon. It's my me and my crew or friends or whatever. Episode five. And that should be out pretty soon. It's getting edited by my friend. It's pretty good. And yeah. Thanks for watching. Peace.